It was a time of great adventure and danger. Shunned by his kin, an Illager wanders the land, seeking a new home. But all he found was hatred. Driven by rage against those who wronged him, he wandered blind to whatever end. Until at long last, the Illager found something that would change him forever. The Orb of Dominance. Corrupted by evil, driven by vengeance, the Arch Illager made all bow before him. And if they did not bow, they would fall. The Illagers raided the land. Who would have the valor, the purity of heart, to stand against the Arch Illagers' reign of terror? Well, not that one. Maybe you. guard was wiped out. Those who kneeled were now at the gates of hell. They were killing us off, burning our seas from shore to shore. We thought there was no way the Empire could win this game. As fate would have it, the tide turned in our favor again. A new wind was at our backs, blowing us straight to heaven. In our new Eden, there was only one rule. First come, first serve. It was dog eat dog. We became kings, queens, lords and masters of our own new worlds. Fortunes poured down on us. They had their empire. Now it was our turn. Enemies became friends. Friends became enemies. The best didn't trust anybody. The philosophy of the day was more and more. We were alone at the top of the food chain. We thought we were. In a dog-eat-dog -dog world, we were wolves. And wolves hunt in packs. Well, look at you. Yeah, I guess you took the hard road. Ah, me too. 
You'd think we'd learn. Now, all in the name of progress, right? They say there's always something better. Burn the old. Bring in the new. Well, how'd that work out? Risked our whole future. And we trusted them. And now we fight them any way we can. For what? I can leave y'all be. What? The grav cycle? I'm a pilot. Uh-huh. It's called a pre-flight inspection. No judgments here, huh? Dad made it sound we were something special. The glue that held it all together. More than a nation. A symbol of freedom and hope. We could bring it all back if we kept on making deliveries and connecting people. He was sure of it. Sam, we want you to go west and finish what Emily started. The people she left behind have been hard at work setting up chiral network terminals. But these terminals are still isolated. We need you to bring them online. And for that, you'll need a Cupid. This is how we'll rebuild our country. Extinction's on hold for now. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. the other 
other mark from? Clinging woman in a cave. I see. Aphanthosomphobia. Sam, I owe you an apology. Lou was the name you were going to give your own baby if he'd had made it. I should have pieced it together sooner. Don't know what you're talking about. You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. Help, Amelie. She needs you. You have to break some ties to forge others. Keep me tied to everything. The world's still broken. Same as before. What isn't? But we're still here. We're still chugging along. Not everyone. Not me. Come on. You put America back together, didn't you? You didn't have to cut all ties and walk away. The president was right about that much. Wasn't anything to walk away from. It's not like I was ever welcome there. Come on. Even I was welcome. Five mass extinctions, each caused by an extinction entity. And now it's time for number six. Take care of Lou. I will. Couldn't find a working still mother east to Port Knot City. Kids done enough. No more. The decommissioning order finally came through. Dead? Poor thing was never truly alive. Not in this world, at least. I had no idea until you told me. No idea that I was alive. Living is no different from being dead if you're all alone. I'm on the beach, Sam. Our beach. The one where I was born. Come and find me. I'm not the only one wearing masks, either. There's your boss man. And that woman. And... Oh! Let's not forget little old you. Did I ever tell you my real name? I wanted to. It's Amerigo. After Amerigo Vespucci, the man who discovered the continent. I thought it was Columbus. Except Amerigo was full of it. He lied. America is a lie. Time. Two, one, On your feet, my child.
day, you may take whatever you need. Do anything you must. For me. For us. Prepare yourself. How big you are? Are you so big? So big. <laughs> and can you sing? Good singing. How about I miss you? Miss you. And I love you. I love you. I love you, Daddy. I love you, Daddy. And I can't wait to see you. Can you say see you? See you. Good then. Bye bye. Bye bye. UNSC Pelican Echo 216. Can you hear me? This is UNS. Power cells are fried. Auto shut down. Triggering survival mode. I'm going to try to overwrite. Okay. If you can hear me in there, I hope you're ready. Please don't die. Please.
Welcome back, Chief. I rerouted what needle power I had into your suit. Hmm. Looks like there's a problem with the servos in your hands. Stay calm. You've been out there a while. I know I saw something in here to check your armor's diagnostics. See there, big guy. You're not. Status report. Status report? What? There's something you need to see, Chief. We lost. Lost everything. There's nothing left for us here. I don't think we're here is. No, 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 no. Not then. Not again. We need to run. No. We need a fight. Get ready. saved my life. He told me never to forget who I am, where I come from. But in this place, nobody even wants to know my name. Getting attached is deadly. Because when darkness comes, I might be gone. This tore society apart, but I won't let it turn me into an animal. Staying alive became the essence of our existence, yet life must be more than just survival. Every day the disease tries to crush us and make us forget who we are, but I keep fighting. My name is Aiden, and I am infected.
found him. Take him. I'll cover you. He's going into stasis. Contact. Head to the extraction point. Are you alone? I just want the money. You got the chip? All right, start her up, bug. Why don't you go to the bathroom, wash up, we gonna be with you in a minute. Wow, oh, come on, man. Your neck, it's a mess. While security has yet to comment, we do know the suspect seems to have fled the scene. Initiating combat mode. Go! Destination confirmed. Woo That's what I'm talking about! All right! In and out, bitches! We're rich! Oh, we are going to the major leagues, Jackie! Right. <laughs> Jack? Oh. oh, shit! No, 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 no. Okay, oh. get to a clinic. Now. Mr. Wells' condition is critical. Go! Immediate medical help okay. is required. Just, just hold on. Just... <sighs> Hey, hey, just think about all the good shit we're gonna have, huh? I'm sorry. Chip decks. Every corporal cop in this city is gonna be blasting down these doors after what you and your psycho friend did. We didn't need all this cocksucking attention, damn it. the fuck up, samurai. We have a city to burn. Guess I have to be the one to tell you. You're dead. This city, we're all 
fighting over scraps here. I've seen it raised by fire, shaken by quakes. Whatever you do in my city, I will hear about it. Seattle is firmly under my control. You're obviously new to this whole existence, but truth is, most of you types won't even make it a whole year. So you probably figured out that you need to drink blood. You can't just do whatever you want. Cities are carved up by political factions. Never tell anyone about what you are. See, vampires are extremely territorial. Unwittingly poaching someone's territory and suddenly whip! We have one rule. You don't break the masquerade. <laughs> Welcome to the first day of the rest of your death. Having fun yet? I'm happy to see you accepted my invitation. All I need you to do is to find a thin blood by the name of Slug. He's in hiding. But the Nosferatu most likely know where he is. Once you find Slug, all you have to do is purchase some information off of him. Feel free to use whatever methods are needed to get him to comply. I assume your handlers have sent you to find our smelly friend. You can find Slug under the freeway or in a place the locals call the jungle. He's smart enough to hide among the homeless down there, but not quite smart enough to do it well. Talk to him about coming to see us, and no one needs to know. We'll let you keep anything you've been promised from whoever sent you to me. But you'll want to watch yourself. Lots of unsavory animals in the jungle. I don't know you. That's a good start. Slug is a coward, but he survived this long on his own, so he's bound to be a handful. He's also not the only one you'll need to look out for. Just let me go. Come on. Just let me leave. there for a while. Now it's all riots, bombings, and people thrown in cages like animals. Oh, and who could forget the killer robots everywhere? So yeah, that's all gone a bit shit. It's up to us to take our city back. Thing is, we can't do it alone. We need to recruit a resistance. I know what you're thinking. Where do we start? Open your eyes and take a look around. Look here. Look at him. No, not him. Him. Former MI5. Duty never ends. He can get anywhere and erase 
anyone. See ya? Let's kick those bastards out of London. She got kicked out of Oxbridge Robotics School for teaching him to, uh, reproduce. <laughs> and that fella over there? Proper belly. Come on, come at me. He'll crack your skull just for looking at funny. <laughs> this had better be fucking good. And allow me to introduce you to the deadliest of the lot. She's not old, she's experienced. Like I said, you can recruit anyone, and I mean bloody anyone. Him, her, everyone is a secret weapon. Find them, recruit them, build the resistance. Let's unfuck this world. Watchdogs Legion. Available March 6, 2020. Check out the Watchdogs Legion 101 trailer. Peggy 16. You know that old saying? Never meet your heroes? Well, I did, and it was awesome. The Avengers were everything I imagined. Hello, San Francisco! Thor, Tony, check it out. At once. Try to keep up. This just got a whole lot more interesting. Let's make this quick. Secure the bridge. Those weapons can't get into the city. Are you set them up? File, knock them down. Thor, what's your status? There are humans trapped. And lots of small, angry men with guns. Is that a joke? Did Thor make a joke? Cap, they got pulsar tanks! Call them murderers. Do the Avengers pose a danger to society? That was the question, Bruce. That was the question. Well, we all lost something that day. But that's not how this story ends. What are we waiting for? 